In a world of ever-evolving threats, USS Gerald R. Ford stands as a beacon of strength and readiness. During their deployment to U.S. 6th Fleet, the Gerald R. Ford Carrier Strike Group played a crucial role in maintaining peace and stability within the region. From the Baltic to the Mediterranean Sea, Ford operated seamlessly alongside NATO allies, demonstrating unparalleled interoperability. Through joint exercises, USS Gerald R. Ford enhances its ability to deter aggression and defend against potential threats. The Gerald R. Ford Carrier Strike Group worked with our NATO allies during exercises Baltic Operations, Air Defender, Bomber Task Force Viking Trident, Neptune Strike, and Sage Wolverine. The strike group operated with standing NATO Maritime Groups 1 and 2, conducted dual carrier operations with USS Dwight D. Eisenhower and exercised with navies from France, Greece, Norway, Turkey, and the United Kingdom. USS Gerald R. Ford launched more than 10,000 sorties while operating in Sixth Fleet and operating with NATO allies. While within the Sixth Fleet area of operations, the carrier visited ports in Croatia, Greece, Italy, Norway, and Turkey bolstering cultural relationships between the United States and our NATO allies. Other ships in the strike group visited Belgium, Cyprus, Montenegro, Spain, and Sweden. The Gerald R. Ford Carrier Strike Group's deployment was extended 76 days following the outbreak of conflict in Israel and operated in the Mediterranean Sea to deter further escalation and support Israel in its right to self-defense. The Gerald R. Ford Carrier Strike Group's deployment to the U.S. Sixth Fleet Area of Operations demonstrates the commitment and power projection capability of the Navy's globally deployed force. The Gerald R. Ford Carrier Strike Group provides an inherently flexible naval force capable of deploying to meet emerging missions, deter potential adversaries, defend our nation and our allies and partners, standing as a testament to the unwavering commitment of the United States and our NATO allies.